To create a page and visualize our data we have many types of page blocks we can use. Let's have a quick look at all of them. Let's choose account for example. Then click on page builder. And then on add block to see the available block types. The content block allows to add a static content, similar to an informative HTML page. Metric allows to highlight a single numeric value that we need to draw attention to. It can be a plain value from a record or a calculated value by means of mathematical operations. The chart block allows to insert a chart, by choosing from the charts available by default, or the ones created by the users. Twitter feed allows to show the Twitter feed, by linking to the URL of the desired Twitter account. Record allows to display and organize the content of the fields of a record. You can select which fields to display and also organize them in multiple record blocks to optimize the space. Also the record block is not available when building new pages from the page menu, but only when you build the record page of a module. Record list allows to display at the same time a list of records coming from a module, such as in the, the pages we find by clicking on account or opportunity. Automation allows to create buttons to activate automation scripts. Calendar allows you to insert and manage a calendar. File allows to insert one or more files statically in our pages. For example, it could be a PDF to be used as a readme file. Record organizer allows to manage data efficiently in the Kanban way by making it easy to create a Kanban board. iframe allows to insert an iframe to display a web content. As in this example, we could display Wikipedia and make it available in a page. Comments allows to enter comments referring to the records in the modules.